Hello world and welcome back to another video. So what is Git and what is GitHub and are they the same thing? So Git is a version control software. And for a while, I didn't really know what that version control part meant. So version control is all about keeping track of the edits that you make to a resource. So let's say the resource is a resume and I'm gonna put somewhere on the screen an example of all the different resumes I created. And as you can see, version control is desperately needed because I have so many different versions and how do you know the difference between like resume not updated and resume old. So with a version control software, I can keep track of the history that I made to all these files and I could easily see what changes, deletions, or updates that I have made. GitHub is a website that stores our version controls or our Git projects. So for example, I could store my resume and all the different updates that happen on GitHub. A question I had in the beginning was, are Git and GitHub the same thing? And the answer is no. So Git is what you use on your laptop, so on your local machine. However, GitHub is actually a website that you visit in your browser. So for example, with GitHub, you need internet connection in order to use it. However, with Git, you don't. You can just use it all locally on your computer. So Git, I want you to think of something to personally keep track of the edits and the changes you make to a resource. However, when you think of GitHub, that's where you're storing these Git projects so that let's say someone else needs to see it or someone else wants to collaborate on it with you, they can do so. So for example, with this related to code, I can locally work on some code and then when I think it's ready to be put into production or to be added to the code base, I can share it on GitHub so that someone on my team can review it and then put it in the master code base or the main code base. At the company I work at, through Git and GitHub, that's how we're able to collaborate, share code, and develop code. So it's a really powerful tool. So I'm over here looking crusty right now, but I just wanted to end the video by saying thank you so much. Like my last video, we were at 18, and now the next video, we at 36 subscribers. Like, ah, we out here, boy. And I just think this is so crazy. So I just wanna say thank you so much. And like, if any of you guys have any questions at all or questions about software engineering, computer science, life in college, like after college, you know, what languages I'm learning, what languages I'm using at work, like anything in, in general, just let me know, just message me and I'll be happy to answer your questions. Like we really out here growing and I just think it's so amazing and it's all to you. So yeah, thank you so much. Have a great day and happy coding.